Jamers290 here, and today I'll be playing Bendy in the Ink Machine, a 1.19.3 map made by Razor, I think his name was. Yep, Razor, there we go. Um, if the name of this map sounds slightly familiar, that's because it's based off of a different, like an actual game that's made by this guy here. Uh, so it's a game by the same name, It's a f and this one here is a fan-made map. So it's going to be interesting to see how it plays out. Um, I've already re read the rules, there's not much to them really. Um, so just stay in event mode, oops, I put myself in survival mode. Uh, we can do that quickly. Yep, there we go. Because uh, when I actually joined the map, he hadn't set up, the map creator had not set up the, uh, hadn't actually left the player in a specific mode. So it meant I wasn't sure which one to be in, but I now realise I should have been an adventure. So there we go, that's that sorted. Single player, oh, apparently we can use slash give to give us items. Or middle click the item to duplicate it when we're in creative mode. But we gotta stay in adventure the whole time. I don't know why you quite put that rules in, in the rules and info book. It's not really something you need. Um, so just notice here, just letting him know that one. Uh, these things you think suit the map. Yeah, fair enough. Uh, and this map was made for well, practices. So this is his first map, from what I understand. So it's good to see that he's at least having a go at it and everything like that. Uh, let's push this button before starting. Oh, okay, interesting. So that does the rain. And then it starts. Fending the Ink Machine by Razter. So this is chapter one. There's no other chapters in it at the moment. Moon Pit is chapter one. So here we go. Alright, Joey, I'm here. Let's see if we can't find, find what you wanted me to see. Gonna explore the studio. So, like I said, this is based off of the video game by the same name. And I'll leave a link to the uh, map down below in the description for those of you who might be interested. So for those of you who aren't aware of the series, this is actually a horror map as well. So it's a horror series, so this is indeed a horror map. I'd imagine I'm supposed to go this way. Yeah, I would say everything's sort of leading me up that path. Okay, so I've got to go up here. That seems suspicious. So I actually haven't even played the actual um, game either, so I'm actually not even sure how this storyline goes in any way, shape or form. This lift looks like it could have been used for a few dry cells. Yeah, this lift looks like it could I could use a few dry cells. Okay. I'm gonna get oak stairs and strip oak log. Punch it all we can. Ooh. Okay, so that just interacts with those. Good, thoroughly barricaded off. I wonder if there's something over a flood bricks. Oh, we're uh, ink bendy. Okay, interesting. This, this, this is interesting. Okay, so dry cell is placed on oak stairs, and a gear can be placed on strip box. The last thing says this lift looks like it could use a few dry cells. 
Let's see, there's heaps of oak stairs. Like everywhere. Oh, here I see what it's gotta be. Okay. Oh. So we get two other new places of oak stairs. So let's see one here, and I would say one there, but that doesn't work. Uh oh. Uh, okay. Oh, I'm not sure. Also, I've got nothing to break it if I misplace it. That's the only problem. It doesn't make it clear where to place it. It's almost could use a few dry cells. The problem is, there's oak stairs everywhere. But stripped oak logs are all of this stuff here. There's nothing. Okay, let's go look for stripped oak logs on the floor. On a floor or on a... So it can also be placed on a stripped oak log. So then I'm just leaving for stripped oak logs on the floor. Uh, because I can't place candles on the wall. So it's have to be something on the floor where I can place these candles. I would imagine. Okay, maybe I was supposed to go this way. I just want to quickly dug into creative mode. I'm um, going just grab that extra wall back in case I need it and place it down and didn't realize. Um, like I know it said stay in the veg, but it didn't give me any way to break them if I'd misplaced them. And I mean, that's not it. Whoa! Okay, so I just triggered something. Hey, it's my old desk. I've wasted so much time in this chair. Because that's right. So I think, if I remember this, thing, this place looks like they've knocked, they knocked out a wall or two after I left. I guess I took a f few people to replace me. Whoa, okay, this is just a little bit weird. Because I think the place is haunted by Bendy, because he's the creation of this specific studio that we're part of, I think. Invoking questions logs again, so this is a interesting map to say the least. And it's kinda got me a little on edge to be honest. So so it's doing something. But if anything, I'm more confused. So I, I would say we can't put these torches down anywhere. Or sorry, candles down anywhere, not yet anyway. I have a feeling this is something to do with this lever seems to be in the way. Dry cells, well, that's a dry cell. So they're supposed to go either side. Ah, oh, that's what we got. Let's see what you're hiding down there, old friend. Let's see what you're hiding down there, old friend. So now do we flip this lever? Whoa, what the... Turn on the ink 
a shame. Oh, that would explain what the ink file and possibly the record the gear is for. Interesting, so it's going to make keep to me now. So go to the turn on the ink machine. And, and, and that is where. Hey, this looks like a new room I didn't see. Oh my gosh. The room has changed. Like, everything shifted. Everything has shifted. Oh my gosh. Weird. So, bendy plush. Ah, uh, I can also, might also suggest the map creator for future creations. Have a look in, look into doing custom resource packs and stuff. Um, it does help immerse people a lot in the experience. It's just a suggestion. So right, despite being a little confusing, let's see that I do want to check that out actually. What the? This is gonna be the ink machine. Oh, I see what you're doing, okay. Oh, yep, it's the bendy plush here. Yeah. Ink file there. The living the gear has got to go. Here. It's empty where the gear goes. Can I the record? No? Okay, so whether we're gonna get that side completed first and then do this side? Could you place the strip tape logs? Um, Mount Creator also, it is a good idea to give um, it's definitely putting me around the hell? Oh god, Joey. What were you doing? That's that's probably a good idea. Yep, let, let's arm myself. Uh-huh. So definitely Kevin Handy. Uh-huh. Yep. Yep. Nope. I agree. Now, so these items you can actually do, if you wanted to, you can actually make them be out of break torches and stuff like that. Um, might be helpful for some people. Look at this slightly disturbing at all. Nope, not not in the slightest. We're back here now. What the hell? This is really weird. Kind of unnerving. So I got a thing from here. This is kind of weird and really unnerving, and the rain and thunder does not help. He moved? No, he hasn't. I'd say I can't go into any of the paintings. So 
I found the ink machine, but I can't place any torch down because I don't have it or something. So I swear he wasn't there beforehand. Does it? No! No, this isn't creepy at all! Not in the damn slightest. Oh my gosh! There's no way he did that. Yep, so... Note to map creator, maybe don't use the item frames unless you'll be able to do it like that. Now I just need to get the ink flowing somehow. Should be a switch around here somewhere. Then I'll start up the main power. There's still the ink swisher. That should do it, I would think. Did I restore the ink pressure? That did, did I, I imagine so. I'm just gonna. Yep. I imagine so. The problem is I can't get rid of those things either. I don't like. I don't like this. This is kind of. It's not so much scary as it is more eerie. Most restore ink push. I'm pretty sure I just restored ink push, did I not? Okay, I just need to get the ink flowing somehow. Should be a switch around here somewhere. And I could start up the main power, and the objective is to restore ink pressure, which uh, uh, I imagine I did. Sink pressure. I feel a little bit safer with my sword, but um, I, I don't know what to do at the moment. Unless I'm missing something? Do you guys see that? That wasn't doing that before, was it? Oh gosh. Oh, it's dark. I don't like this. Something's gonna jump out and scare me in the... <sighs> okay. Should I do escape the workshop? Okay. I'm trying. I don't know where I'm going. Not that way, apparently. Whoa. I don't like this. It's it's um it's rather dark in here. Oh, I want to go down. Well, I guess I'm gonna have to. Oh my gosh. Um, of course, it did nothing.
gonna jump in, can't we? I just know it. Okay, I think. I'll just grab that. This can break stuff. Oak signs of oak fence. this at all. Whoa! That was weird! Okay. Stay tuned for chapter two. I think I will, you know? Nerd. Well, nerd can't push button. Or maybe I can't get around. Okay, let's see. Haha, <laughs> nice! Okay, I like that little tribute, that was good. Anyway guys, if you enjoyed watching, please like and subscribe. And make sure to comment down below. And I will see you all in the next one. Bye!